Are you African American? I don't, I don't understand the question. It all came crashing down for NAACP Spokane President Rachel Dolezal, who has been portraying herself as a black woman for the past 10 years. Confronted by a reporter, her parents are now calling her out. Ruth Ann and Lawrence Dolezal say their 37-year-old daughter is white. We are her birth parents, and we do not understand why she feels it's necessary to misrepresent her ethnicity. Her ethnicity, the elders say, is Swiss, German, Czech, and some Native American. They provided this photo of Rachel as a young girl on the left. On the right, here's what she looks like today. It seemed like she was <clears throat> just doing more of an uh, artistic, expressive representation of her identifying with African Americans by doing her hair and extensions and things like that. Rachel grew up in predominantly white Montana, but her parents say she immersed herself in the black community when she attended college in Jackson, Mississippi. Rachel's parents had also adopted four black children. Rachel has always been interested in ethnicity and diversity, and we had many friends of different ethnicities when she was growing up. So it didn't start with the four adopted children of color. It was uh, probably that added to her passion. Rachel even received a full scholarship to the historically black college, Howard University, which never inquired about her ethnicity on her application. Eyes were popping and jaws were dropping when she walked in to finalize her registration in person. But the Dolezals say they became estranged from their daughter when she began to assume a new black identity. Rachel married an African-American man, Kevin, with whom she had a son who posted a video about their love. Later, Rachel would post Facebook pictures of one of her adopted brothers as her own son, referred to her natural curls, and identified herself on a job application as part black. As professor of Africana Studies at Eastern Washington University, Rachel was clear. I would definitely say that yes, I do consider myself to be black. But it was the questionable death threats and reported hate crimes against Rachel and her family, which led to an investigation and questions about her race. In January, the Spokane chapter of the NAACP posted a picture of Dolezal standing beside this black man who Rachel claimed was her father. She said he couldn't visit Spokane because he was battling lung cancer. Is that your dad? Yeah, that's, that's my dad.